Hey everybody, welcome back to a brand new episode of New Rifles. My name is Koen Bills from the Fellowship of Acoustics and this week we have a lot of interesting guitars for you. So let's not wait any longer and kick off with guitars. The first one here is this beautiful Andy Manson Magpie. Um, Andy Manson is, uh, is one of our favorite guitar makers. He builds in such a special way with um, a, such a unique approach on guitar making. At one point he made a guitar that was entirely shaped like a mermaid. Uh, Go check it out online. It's 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 super nice what he does. Um, this Magpie is kind of an OM shape. It's slightly larger. Uh, Rosewood back and sides, spruced up. As you can see, everything is unique shaped. So from the bridge to the fretboard to the headstock to the back of the headstock, even here the heel cap. You know, it's everything has eye for detail. And even though the guitar, you know, it doesn't have a lot of appointments. No abalone. It is still a treat to watch. The guitar is built incredibly light, it has a super nice open and vibrating tone. So as some of you have might seen, um, this year is our 20th anniversary and we are super stoked. And when we started to think about 20 years last year, I think about 15, 16 uh, months ago, uh, we started, oh, we need to do some collaborations with, with some brands. And some of these guitars actually got in this week, we already had some, uh, but this week we got a, a really nice batch from both Eastman and Martin, um, both are new rifles, and we start off with the Eastman. The first collaboration was uh, was with Eastman. We called them up, and they were immediately excited. And we've come up with uh, with more models. But the first one that arrived is this beautiful T64 in black, beautiful H finish, Lola P90 pickups. The Bixby on top of that. It's it's a hollow uh, body. Even though the Bixby is installed, the guitar is still very light, very resonant, and. Uh, yeah, it's an absolute rock and roll machine. They are very limited, so if you want one, go check out the website. The next one here is in trade-in, and when these were released, I think back in 2014, I'm not entirely sure, it could be 2013 as well, I was super stoked. So at one point, Brent Ferguson uh, left Gibson, and nobody actually knew where he was. He showed up at Fender, he made some American Fenders acoustic, but then Guild was purchased by the quarterback group, and um, Brent Ferguson was transferred to guilt and then he could show true acoustic craftsmanship. So this RV model has Adirondack top, Indian rosewood back and sides, super nice rope inlay and it's, it is a really cool blend because you can feel there is some Gibson vibe in this guitar uh, but at the same time you can feel it's a very strong and powerful guilt guitar as well with that known mid presence that they have. It's, uh, it's super nice. It's a very suitable guitar for both strumming and finger picking. There's already a K, &K Trinity installed. You can go on stage straight away. Um, yeah, it's very nice. So another collaboration we did was with Martin. Martin was immediately excited as well. And what we did with Martin is we um, created five different models that look a lot like reimagined models, but are not. So uh, this D28, for instance, has Adirondack spruced up, Adirondack bracing, and is built by the custom shop. And the idea that we had is it should be close to reimagined, also price-wise, but should be built by custom shop, should have an Eddy top, Eddy bracings, to really give that punch and an extra 
you know, extra bit of bytes. I think we succeeded very well uh, on them. So all the five models are on the website. On top of our 20th anniversary, we're also going to host a festival. So the festival is on the 4th of September, uh, next week, Saturday. There will be great live music. There will be beer, there will be good food. So everything you need for a nice festival, right? And Kuhn will be there. So if you're interested and if you're around, um, on, the tickets are on, on, on sale on our website, so I hope to see you then. Yeah, super dreadnought. So on top of this, we got also OM18s, triple O18s, D18s, and an OM28. Awesome models. Also with these five models we only made limited numbers so if you're interested in a really nice guitar with some super upgrades so you have a, quite a unique guitar but you don't want to pay custom shop money for it then go check out the website so and the last guitar for you is a vintage treat what do we think of this beautiful 1933 lo so the lo is basically the same model as the l double uh, super nice black finish toy toys big arts Really nice wear and tear. So this is how they should look as an old blues picker. Also singer-songwriters really love old LWOs and LOs. Let's listen to them. So that were the guitars for this week. Uh, if you want to see them in depth, go to our website or go to our YouTube channel. We uh, made some demos with Life the Leo, awesome blues guitarist. Um, so I'm sure you will enjoy uh, his playing a lot more than mine. Life is also playing on the festival. So if you don't know his band, go check it out. You'll be blasted away. He, they are awesome. They're really good. Go check it out on the festival. Yeah, go check it out on the festival. We can have a beer together. Big thumbs up. So that was it for guitars. I really hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you enjoyed the guitars and I hope to see you in the next New Arrivals. Bye bye.